As we're getting this new season of Pirelli World Challenge underway, one of the enthralling things is the influx of some great new cars and some drivers in both of the categories. After some running now, rumbling through the paddock, prettiest car by far is the one from Black Swan Racing, this beautiful Mercedes that's been brought into the program. And I'm with team owner and driver Tim Pavis. And Tim, about a decade ago, you ran World Challenge, but in touring car, you're now back with some serious GT Thunder. What's the draw? What brought you back to World Challenge? Well, honestly, um, Pirelli World Challenge has continued to get more and more competitive, and when the opportunity came up with the Mercedes SLS AMG GT3 to bring it to the United States to be the first to campaign it in the North American Racing Series, Black Swan Racing jumped at the chance, and we're, we're really excited to be here. Um, I, had, I have a lot of fond memories of racing in Pirelli World Challenge, and obviously it's a big step from touring car to GT, uh, but I'm really excited and I think after several years of running GT cars in endurance championships, this is going to be a fun change to go, go for it at the start and see what happens. No share in the car, it's all selfish about you and this beast in, in, in 50 minutes. You've run GT Challenge Porsches, you took a shot at some LMP2 racing, so you've driven some, a wide variety of stuff. What's this thing like to drive? You know, the uh, AMG SLS GT3 is, it's a fantastic car. It's really, really balanced. It's really easy to drive. It's the kind of car that when you drive it, you think, you know, you could triple stint at Sebring without any problems. So in a 50-minute race, you know, I think that we're going to have some really, a big advantage on tire degradation. It's very easy on its tires, and it's easy on me. So hopefully we can stay, you know, head down and, and go after it. We're looking forward to you flogging it uh, just a little while. Thanks so much for taking the time. Thank you.